Hello, Gamer Clone here. Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to take a look at the GB Boy Color using the Game Boy Game Genie here. So let's put this in the slot here. It does feel a little bit awkward and wait, but most importantly, we want to find out if it's going to play at all. So, what I have today here is Zelda Link is Awakening. Uh, now I have it in the wrong direction here. See, it's not the way you put it in. This is the way you put it in. Back in. Let's turn it on. So, I had to go online for the codes because I don't have the code book. And, so far we got progress. With Link's Awakening, I got a code for infinite energy. We'll check it out. Go ahead and enter this code. F A Oh, nine, 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 four, C, one. All right. Get a little quick intro with Link's Awakening. So far, it's playing. It's not crashing. Let's check this out. I'll go to my current game here. All right. Let's try to see if they'll do take any damage. No damage. Nope. I'm not losing any hearts. I only got three hearts. And my little dog here ate it. And I say sorry about the movement. And even falling down holes does damage. And I'm taking no damage. My hearts are still at three. So we know the Game Genie works for this. So what are your thoughts on using Game Genie for Game Boy? Would you consider and use it on the GB boy color I didn't see any glitches as you saw and only problem I have with it is the awkward weight it is kind of weird but other than that it works no problem so I have one more experiment I'm going to do in the next video which I've tested on previously it is using it on this little Game Boy color adapter it also does Game Boy we'll save that for a future video well, thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and I will see you next time.